Okay, hello, welcome back to Forest Lawn Memorial Park, Long Beach. I'm here because I found out there's another notable person who was interned here uh, at the park. Actually, uh, three more actually. But uh, let's cover the first one here because this was the hardest one ever. Okay, so let's go down here. This is the uh, okay, largest section. Okay, so. I found out about this on the Graveyard Channel, used to be uh, Finding Graves with Snow, and I learned about the death of a, uh, of a person who died due to animals, okay. and uh, she was actually uh, a snake trainer and had, uh, had worked in several movies, Jungle Red movies, uh, she's like the reptile consultant, uh, most especially the, uh, the Tarzan down the name and all the information they need to the office to find it and they gave me a map. Okay, so I'm pointing out the okay, larger section which I am at now. Okay, this is the walk. Okay, so <laughs> with this so hard is actually my fourth time coming here looking for it. I actually looked for the grave in this area. This area around this area right here. Okay. Okay, because the map said the border of the section this was the border the walkway and i've been i searched everywhere around this area okay i couldn't find it okay i did it like the first two times i couldn't find it i actually walked everywhere along the section okay because i knew that this was the border the galarja then i actually had to go to find a grave have someone take a picture of the grave okay and uh, just to give me a landmark on where it is okay and I did get the picture okay and the picture the only landmark gave me was this area right here okay it didn't show the building but it showed some trees and that trash can right there and the middle see the middle trash can next to the tree okay so I assumed since there are graves here that are like you can see here it comes to a point one right here, run over here. I thought it'd be around this area because, like I, like I said, I thought this was the whole okay, largest section because, based on the map, this is the, the walkway. Okay, so the third time I couldn't find it. I tried to match the angles, the point here, and I still couldn't find it. it should be close, especially around this section. And then I had a hunch. I just noticed something, especially the first time I came here, that the uh, the markers were really off. Like they were in the hundreds, and the marker I was looking for was like 36, and I couldn't find anything lower than that right here. And then just on the gut feeling, I decided to cross the border. Okay, right here. Okay. Because this next section, I forgot the name actually. I thought it was not Galaria. Based on that map given to me by the office and telling me that this walkway was the border. Turns out they, sh they were wrong. This section is actually also Galaria. And as you can see, the graves also kind of like comes to a point. One going this way, one going that way. And it kind of like also fit the angle right here of the picture I got from the person who was nice enough to give me, you know, kind of like a landmark for it. It kind of matched up. So I went to the part where there was a point. It's either this point or that point. Okay. And I just walked through here and found the grave of Grace. Olive Wiley. Okay, go over here. Grace Olive Wiley. Okay, hang on. I don't get lost again. Okay, because I thought I took some pictures to make sure I give a better landmark. You know, he could have <laughs> at least landmarked that tree. It was cut off on his photo or this tree behind me. Okay, so uh, 
and look for it. Okay, hang on. Already spotted it. I just had to shoot the video here. So, oh, here it is. Okay, there you go. Okay. And there she is. Daughter Grace Olive Wiley, born 1883, died 1948. And uh, she is what they call a uh, hepatomologist. Um, uh, let me see if I got that right. Yeah, but she, uh, she studied in snakes. Okay. Let me pull up her Wikipedia page here and give you the whole story of how she died. Oh, sure, I've gotten ready. There we go. There we go. Grace Olive Wiley, 1984. No month or day. Died July 20, 1948. American herpetologist. Yeah. Best known for her work with venomous snakes. She died of a snake bite she received while posing for a photographer at the age of 64. Yeah. So yeah, she was bitten by a rattlesnake. Let's see the story right here. Okay. It was very controversial, but she worked in several movies, especially the Tarzan movies I mentioned uh, earlier. Okay, so yeah, so here's the story. On that day, July 20, 1948, Wiley invited journalist Daniel P. Mannix to photograph her collection. While she was posing with a venomous Indian cobra, the flash from the photographer's camera spooked the snake and it lunged. She restrained it but was bitten, and she requested to be taken to the hospital. Unfortunately, uh, her only vial of cobra antivenom uh, was accidentally broken and the hospital had anti venom serums only for North American snakes. Wiley is pronounced dead less than two hours after being bitten. Okay. Although family and friends tried to preserve her collection, it was ultimately auctioned off and the snake that killed Wiley was subsequently displayed at an Arizona roadside attraction. Okay. There we go. So, yeah. So, uh, let me see what else. Uh, all right, the movie she worked on is Moon Over Burma, The Jungle Book, and as the aforementioned Tarzan series. Okay, so yeah, so let me show you a picture of her. I hope I can clear it up. Okay. Hard to see, huh? Oh, well, I'll post it on my uh, Facebook page. Okay, also interesting, uh, this is Mary Aga. This is... Uh, her mother, so they're buried together. Born 1861, died at 1951. Okay, but almost three years after her daughter died by snake bite. Okay, there you go. So, <laughs> so yeah, this was quite an adventure because, yeah, you thought that walkway was the border, but it was not. Even the office made a mistake maybe I'll let them know if in the map you don't see the walkway okay basically it's one area and I'm assuming this is the border actually this is actually the border to the next section yeah okay and if you want to visit uh, the notable Grace Olive Wiley okay as I mentioned I took photos actually for this landmark on this tree this is the angle you need to see okay and this tree behind me right here also took a picture of that so uh, we could narrow down where we can find her grave yeah the person uh, you know uh, who I asked to take a photo yeah when you took a picture of this this area right here you get the angle it was this angle yeah basically like that and uh, I noticed that you could not see the walkway on my right side because I, uh, I was told that was the border. Turns out the walkway was on my left side. That's why I kept trying to angle it while I was over there and I couldn't get the right angle. And if I did get the right angle, I still couldn't find it because it was not in that section. Despite trying to match the grapes that, you know, that comes to a point right here. See one going parallel here, one going that way. All it comes to a point, this area. So. This is actually the border to the next section. Yeah. They should make that very clear. Because, I guess you could say four times the charm. Alright, there you go. 
So I'll post this video on my uh, on my secondary YouTube page. You can enjoy and uh, I guess uh, research uh, on your own. Besides what I uh, said, if you don't believe what I said. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So with that, see you at the next grave site.